In this demo, we are going to explore some of the teaching and learning features of Google Workspace for Education Plus and the teaching and learning upgrade, which can help you enable virtual and hybrid learning experiences across your organization. First, licensed users can host meetings with up to 250 participants. There's nothing you need to do. This feature is available by default. Next, Education Plus users can host live streams with up to 100,000 in-domain and cross-domain participants. Teaching and Learning Upgrade users can host live streams with up to 10,000 participants. And both users can enable captions during live streams. In addition to captions in English, licensed users can now enable live translated captions in Meet, which will translate English meetings into Spanish, French, Portuguese, and German. You can also record Meet meetings, with recorded meetings saved automatically to Google Drive. Admins can enable the ability for users to record in the Admin Console by going to Apps, Google Workspace, Google Meet, Meet Video Settings, Recording. Licensed users hosting a Meet meeting can enable breakout rooms by clicking on the Activity menu in the lower right-hand corner creating up to 100 rooms simultaneously. You can even set up breakout rooms in advance from Google Calendar. You can also enable both polls and Q&A in your meetings. Meeting organizers will automatically receive an email after the meeting with results from polls and Q&A, as well as an attendance report for meetings with more than five participants. Powered by AI, noise cancellation reduces unwanted distractions and is available to licensed users. Finally, coming later in 2022, licensed users will have the ability to join meetings from docs, sheets, and slides with embedded Meet calls. For more information on managing Google Meet in hybrid and virtual learning environments, see the checklist linked in the video caption below.